Thanks for joining us for a quick setup and review of the White Duck Avalon 16.5. So first we lay out the ground sheet, we stake it down, then we roll out the tent, orienting the door where you would like. You stake down all the corners, and then we're going to take the center pole, and we're going to insert it right up into the middle to start the setup. Then we insert the A-frame, run the guy line out, and then we run a guy line out from each corner. There's about 12 in total. And you'll have to adjust these to get it just right. So everybody asks us about our tent. They stop and talk to us all about it. So I'm gonna give you a little tour of what the tent is, how it works, and uh, what it looks like inside. So this is a white duck, a white duck 16 and a half Bell Avalon is the type. It's kind of your old canvas circus style tents. Um, it's fairly easy to set up, but it does take a lot of time. Um, if you're doing it by yourself, it's just a lot of uh, a lot of stakes to deal with. So let's go inside and take a look real quick. So inside the tent, uh, it states it can sleep 12 people in here. I've had uh, I've had seven in here with plenty of room to spare, so I, I believe it. Um, I didn't pitch it very good, so the floor is kind of wrinkled up, but it's just a center pole that holds for support. And then we just have one pole that goes up by the door frame and down. Plenty of windows all the way around for airflow and ventilation. And the neat feature is it comes with a stove jack built into it, so for winter camping. I just roll up the outside of this and I, can, I have a stove that fits inside here and uh, can keep us warm in the winter time when it's snowing outside. Also because this is canvas, it's uh, completely waterproof. Um, people set these tents up for a year at a time even and um, have, don't have any issues with them. So, so far so good. Um, just a quick, quick note on their um, customer service, if you will. Their customer service is fantastic. Um, I had a problem with the zipper when I first got it and um, where it was sticking a little bit and I tried some stuff to get it fixed. It wasn't working for me. It's probably user error. Contacted the company and they gave me a, a good chunk of my money back in order to uh, satisfy me or give me the option of replacing the tent. So I was sure I could fix it somehow, but um, it's working good now. I've had it out a few times and uh, it's working great. Um, let me show you another little feature here. It has this nice little hook on top. So that hook you can great for hanging a lantern or light. I mean, I wouldn't recommend a lantern, but people I have seen do it. Um, it's got ventilation at the top, which really helps with condensation. And again, the vents along the bottom. Um, also, this entire floor is detachable. It unzips all along the bottom there, all the way around. And you can actually roll up the, the sidewalls, which those tie-offs right here are for, and use it in your backyard as a entertainment entertaining area uh, for parties and such. This is the medium size one. They do make a smaller one that's 10 feet and they make a couple bigger ones too that go all the way up to 25 feet, I believe. So it's uh, quite the tent.